Hello, in this video we're going to demonstrate how to build multiple firewall network domains in AWS Transit Gateway using Aviatrix version 4.6. Let's get started. So what are the steps that are required in order to be able to have multiple firewall networks as part of the same Transit Gateway? First, we have to create multiple firewall network domains. Let's just say in this case we're going to have one for east-west traffic inspection, which is VPC to VPC and VPC to on-premises, and one for north-south, which is egress and ingress. Then we would go ahead and uh, deploy our gateways as well as the firewalls in the same fashion that we did in the previous videos with a single firewall network deployment. After that, we're going to go ahead and configure the connection policies in such a way that a given domain that needs to have access to both east-west and north-south firewall networks has access to both. And then lastly, in firewall network domain settings, we will make sure that one is set up for ingress and egress inspection and, and the other one is set up for east-west inspection. Let's take a quick look at how we do this in the user interface. Okay, so first up is to add our security domains. I'm going to have two security domains in this demo. One is going to be north-south and one is going to be east-west as mentioned earlier. We do that as a part of Transit Gateway Orchestrator plan, uh, step number two. Okay, so once we're done with creating these security domains, we will move on to creating the security policies. Okay, security connection policies are under Transit Gateway Orchestrator plan, step number three. And here we want to select whatever domain that needs to be able to have access to both of these firewall networks and then make sure that these two firewall networks are added into the connected section. In this example, I'm choosing prod domain and I want to make sure that both of the firewall networks for north-south inspection and east-west inspection basically are added in there. And the better way to say this is that that particular domain, prod domain now, has access to ingress and egress and it will also have uh, the security policies to inspect east-west turned on through the east-west firewall network. Okay, so the last step here is to configure the firewall network for appropriate uh, direction of traffic inspection. So I'm going to go firewall network and go to advanced. So I see that in, in the Oregon region I have the east-west and I have the north-south. So I'll go ahead and click on east-west and uh, go to details. In the details, we have traffic inspection turned on for that particular firewall network. However, we do not turn on egress through this firewall network. Close that out, go back to the north-south, and here we want to enable egress but we do not want to have traffic inspection or the east-west basically turned on so I'm just gonna go ahead and turn on egress and that's successfully done now any domain that's connected to both of these firewall networks essentially has access to egress through north-south domain and it is going to inspect traffic east-west between VPCs and VPCs to on-prem using the east-west firewall network domain. I hope you found this video useful in helping you set up multiple firewall network domains. Remember to check out our documentation page at docs.aviatrix.com. And also remember, you can always reach out to us at support.aviatrix.com. Thank you for watching. Have a good day.